almost on scene. There's definitely smoke, but no visible signs of fire. Looks more like signal flares. Gonna say this is probably a false alarm or a prank. Copy that. You're clear to proceed. Ah, I told you this was a prank. I don't see any fire. <sighs> who in their right mind finds this kind of thing funny? People who enjoy causing a commotion. Huh. Hey, check it out. What the hell? Hmm. Oh, shit. Ugh. Can't we just report this one in and go? Come on, man. You know we can't just leave this be. In Japan, 99.9% .9 of criminal trials end with a guilty verdict. That makes the odds for a defense lawyer to get an acquittal about 10,000 to 1. But I beat those odds on a murder case. It's a hell of an achievement. Unfortunately, it came with a price. The death of an innocent woman. The shadows of truth escape the courtroom, and when they do, Someone has to drag them back into the light. The reality is, the law is neither as perfect or as fair as it's supposed to be. So I've made it my job to give those without a voice a chance to be heard. Hit me with some trivia then. That would pass the time. Oh, I mean, come on, man. You never know how long a stakeout's gonna last. Even Keiko chan's losing her mind. I'm sure she is. Give me a sec to come up with a zinger, okay? Okay, sure. You think up a tough question, and I just leave you to your thoughts. Wait a damn minute! How does that even solve this problem then, man? Um, Kaito-san? I don't think I'm really in the mood for trivia at the moment. Okay, fine. We gotta spice this up somehow. So, Keiko-chan, this internet boy, how'd you end up on the raw end of a scam like this? How is this spicing things up? Besides, we don't even know for sure if it was a scam yet, right? Exactly. Kaito-san here is just jumping to conclusions. It'll be fine, Keiko-san. Don't worry. At Yagami Detective Agency, we make sure our clients' hearts are at the heart of our business. <laughs> That's so great to hear. I know I hired just the right people. Damn straight. Sunshine and rainbows with us. Kosuke-kun did say he always eats fast food for lunch. Yeah, but after 20 minutes, you'd think he'd be done by now. I don't know. He always makes me worry, even his eating habits. Say, Keiko-chan, how'd a sweet girl like you get roped in by some dude off the net, huh? I wouldn't call it that at all. Would you believe me if I said we took it slow at first? say his patience paid off. Maybe it's hard for you to see, but he is a caring guy. So he drags you to the shadiest dive in Kamurocho and calls it a date? <laughs> it's 
Sounds like a real He was just trying to impress me. He couldn't have known what would happen. I mean, he said... So they be present. Yeah. Yeah. Same. Not besides. But he's been defending. Good for you. But... Kosuke-kun. I'm gonna need to follow him. You two stay here. Hopefully we'll get this all cleared up. <laughs> About time we saw some action. Careful out there, Tuck. Hey, Tuck, you read me? You gonna be okay tailing this guy? Or do you need the detective basics manual? Kaido-san, please. I can tail him in my sleep. <laughs> the manual says to keep your eyes open, actually. All right, let's go. Delete that app? Must be my imagination. It's okay. Son. Good call.
Kajosan, just sent that photo to your phone. Yeah. So that's an. Man, I haven't seen you in forever, Sakura-chan. It's because you barely show up to the club events, Kosuke Senpai. I probably wouldn't have seen you today either if I hadn't mistaken someone else for you. Sorry, I just. I know you've got a bit. A lot of girls quit because you stopped showing up. Oh. Damn, that sucks. Yeah, that'd be yeah? great. I hope you won't do anything that'll get those girls' hopes up either. I don't know if you know this, but the girls had a few big fights at all that it Yeah, well... Okay. Off here. That time already. Whoa. Did I lock the door? Shit. Guess it's okay. I need one of those. Must be my imagination. Hey, wait a sec. That's Yagami. He's the detective who reported Anaki's affair to his old lady. Yeah, fuck that guy. Anaki got so pissed, he took it out on us! Still fucking sore about it! Yo! Yagami! Just your luck to be passing by us today! You're a dead man, bro! Man, this neighborhood never changes, does it?
Oh yeah, I need to get more cash. Guess I'll stop by the Popo. Whoa. Oh crap, I don't have it. Probably nothing. Is it trash day again? Guess it's okay. Up to. Not a whole lot right now. He's just wandering around town. Pretty much killing time like your average college student. Any idea where he's headed? Good question. Actually, he just ducked into a building. I'm going after hey, him. Hey, buddy. You new here? And why not? Because I said so. Hey, didn't I tell you to leave? Isn't that a little... Well, there's nothing to... There's definitely more to this place. No way that's gonna work. Hmm. Hey. What the? Hey. No way that's gonna work. Suspicious. Suspicious. What the?
talk. You hanging in there, buddy? Uh, kind of hit a wall here. What's that supposed to mean? You didn't lose the guy, did you? Look, my hands are tied right now, but everything's under control. Oh, uh, hey guys. Didn't mean to interrupt. Hey, who's this clown? First time I've ever seen him. Oh, you see, I'm, uh, Kosuke's guest. Guess I took a wrong turn somewhere. Who the hell's Kosuke? Ah, uh, that's the kid who keeps hanging around. You'd think he'd have wised up by now. Wait, then he'd be on the fifth floor. So what are you doing down here? Seriously, it's like you got me lost on purpose. You mind, uh, pointing me in the right direction? Take the stairs to the fifth floor, then head all the way back. Your friend will be in the tatami room. The tatami room? Oh, of course. <laughs> Should've known this wasn't it. Before you go, I'm gonna need to verify your membership. Kosuke give you a card? Uh, he should have? Shoot, I can't seem to find it. <laughs> That's so. Well, now we got a problem. Sorry. I'll be more careful next time, promise. There won't be a next time, dumbass! We don't carry cars here! Now who the hell are you, and how'd you get in? Better start talking! Ugh, here we go. Tell me, what's Kosuke doing in the tatami room? We're not telling you shit! I'm still in that building with Kosuke-kun. Had a little run-in with some watchdogs. And apparently, Kosuke's no stranger. Right now, he's in their tatami room. Oh, he is, huh? What do you think he's up to? Well, a betting man would say he's gambling. If it's a members-only building with goons posted on every corner, I'm telling you now, the tatami room ain't no tea shop. Huh. Not a bad theory at all. It's like you're speaking from experience, Kaito-san. <laughs> You've got questions? I've got answers. I said we have an intruder! I don't know how he got in! Say what? 
What happened? You there? Tell me something, Tog. Why is a college kid hanging out with a bunch of gambling when we're seeing this kid? Yeah, innocent. Well, Holy better be careful here. I heard we got an intruder. Yeah. Okay, that makes sense. All right.
do it. Just stand there. Shut the door already. Come on! Come on! You know you're wrong. Are you kidding? Huh? <laughs> Can't. Jeez, go ahead hey. and tell the whole. All right, Kaito-san, you called it. Kosuke-kun just blew all his earnings on Chohan. Huh, as I said. Huh. Good, I'll bring it. Hey, man, hold up a sec. I think you dropped something. Huh? I've got my phone on me. What'd I lose? Well, it could be any number of things, to tell you the truth. Maybe your conscience, or even your integrity. You feel like you might have left those somewhere? Huh? What's your freaking problem? Does scamming a young lady ring any bells for you? You've been working with a crooked bar to make her foot a 1.2 million yen bill. What in the hell are you even talking about, dude? Have you conned so many girls you can't even keep the scam straight anymore? You better back off me. I've got the full support of the Tojo clan on this thing, man. Still think it's wise to talk shit? The Tojo clan? You mean the Yakuza? <laughs> Pissing yourself yet? You're about to be real sorry, asshole! <laughs> the Tojo clan thugs got disbanded ages ago. If name dropping a long dead gang was supposed to scare me, I'm not very impressed. Son of a. Let's fucking go! I wouldn't do that if I were you. That excuse for a punch told me all I need to know. Fuck you, man! That last one was just a warning shot! No more chances. The gloves are coming off right now, bro, and you're gonna get fucked up! I hear you, kid. So, I can take the gloves off too, right? The fuck? You for real right now? Well, I pump iron at the gym once a week, my man. You're going down. <laughs> Don't say I didn't warn you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Yoshiro-san! Over here! Kosuke, what He did. Client. Look, I don't have time to- Too late, asshole. 
You just signed up for a beating! Now you're really asking for it. Hold up! Get away from me! What do you want? You won't get away. Come on, Kosuke Kun. Are you done? <laughs> you can't help yourself, can you, Tom? For being a lawyer, you sure like to settle things with your fists. A, a lawyer? How the fuck are you a lawyer? Yagami san, you're not really a detective? I'm a detective, all right. As for the badge, I still have a license to practice, so I hold on to it. Is it safe to assume, then, you used to work at Genda Law? Yep. Hit the nail on the head, actually. These days, he hands off the gigs that are better suited for detectives, like him. Now it's making a little more sense. Did you catch all that, Kosuke-kun? <laughs> huh? Well, if you want a closer look, I'll be more than happy to accommodate you. What? Yeah, care to go for a ride? <laughs> We're gonna be buds, Kosuke. Whoa, time out! Guys, this isn't funny! They stab things off me! I swear this is all a mistake! Kosuke-kun... Uh, Yuko-chan! Don't let these assholes con you! Believe me! I didn't do anything wrong! Who the hell are these thugs? Who is Yuko-chan? Uh, well... My name is Keiko, you jerk! And you think I trusted you? Here's the deal, Kosuke-kun. First, you're gonna cancel her debt to that bar. But that's not even my call. Second, they'll be returning every yen she paid. Plus a little extra for us having to deal with you. You're out of your freaking mind! I have a pretty good idea. <laughs> hey! That's my phone! 
Dial up that bar for me, would you? Drop the act. Oh, you mean it's they got the... The guy... You know, yeah, what's still... Kids, oh, you still... Uh. Yo. Hey. Uh, yeah. <laughs> no? Yeah, you... Wait a minute. Oh, damn. Right. What? Wait a minute. I said, Jeff. Oh. So, no matter, you, that's...